whatever happened to me happened because I've always been terrified of failure. I don't want as much to succeed as much as I don't want to fail. I come from a very normal lower middle class family. I saw a lot of failure. My father was a beautiful man and the most successful failure in the world. At an early age after my parents died, I equated poverty with failure. I just didn't want to be poor. So when I got a chance to act in films, it wasn't out of any creative desire. I say this honestly. It was purely out of the fear of failure and poverty. Most of the films I signed were discards of better known actors and the producers could not find anyone else to do them. I did them all to make sure that I was working to, av to avoid unemployment. Firstly, it's not the absence of failure that makes you success. It is your response to failure that actually helps to buffer the reverses that you experience. I personally have one response to failure, pragmatism. A recognition and belief that if one approach does not work, then the other will or might. Repeated failure has taught me to stop pretending I'm someone else. It's given me the clarity to stick to things that really matter to me instead of distracting me from my core. Failure also gets you to find who your real friends are. The true strength of your relationships only gets tested in the face of strong adversity. Overcoming some of my failures has made me discover that I have a strong will and more discipline than I suspected. It has helped me to have confidence in my ability to survive. You have to know and learn that life is not just a checklist of acquisitions, attainments and fulfillments. And when you fail, you don't, and you fail, you fail well enough to succeed the next time. Don't be afraid of being afraid. Be afraid of not facing your fears and failure.